Cameron Kusha, Senior Analyst at RP Data. There's a lot of information out in the market these days and a lot of it's quite scary. What sort of information do you need to know though about before you buy a property? Well before you buy a property you need to know what the local market's doing. So basically the important stuff to know is the median house price or unit price depending on what you're, sent, you're selling, uh, the average time it takes to sell a property, the level of discounting in the market and it's also good to have a good measure of how many properties are available for sale at the same time you're looking to bring your property to market and what sort of buyer demand there is out there. So how many sales happen in the market on a regular basis. So look at the yearly trends and see how many properties transact on an annual basis. So where can you find that sort of information and is it expensive to dig out? The, the information's readily available from a number of sources. Obviously a newspaper and your uh, online is a, good, is a good tool to find out how much property is being advertised for sale. And a lot of those papers and, and online tools will also have free information about median prices and sales volumes. Other than that, you can also go to the RP Data website and there's data available to be purchased from there. And how important is it to know the performance of the capital city that you're living in when you're deciding on a particular area? Well, it's good for a benchmark and it's good to give you a, a broad representation of the trends. But if you're looking to buy or sell in a market, it's certainly more important to understand what's happening locally. So it'll give you an idea of what you could expect, but then you need some more specific information to what you're actually looking to buy. Okay, thanks very much.